Even through challenging conditions, all of our surfers rose to the occasion here on day two of the ISA World Surfing Games. We went through main event rounds and rapid-charge rounds in a big way. Kolohe now back at it. Uh, a surfer like Kolohe is fired up, firing on all cylinders, doing wow. Kolohe and Dino things like team camaraderie. Well, my name is Giancarlo Oli Gonzalez from Team Panama. Uh, this is uh, one of the chance to be in the Paris 2024 in the Olympic Games. So we have to work in a lot and then they have more days. I'm so happy, super happy. Great surfing. I love the way he surfs, love the read. Rio Waid, a massive turn on the outside. Backing up that outside maneuver. Hello, I'm Rio Waid and I'm from Indonesia. Yeah, I mean, the Tokyo 2020 was very big. For, it was very big for me. I learned a lot and then changed my life for sure. Yeah, I want to go Paris 2024. That's my goal. And that includes the best of the best, like we're watching right here, Perez two of the best snaps we've seen of the day. I'm seeing full effort right now from Brian Perez. <laughs> that is definitely going to be the best way of this heat. Beautiful outside turn. Lines up the close out. Get through not catching a wave. Beautiful inside turn. coming through. Wow. Liking what I'm seeing here, the waves are picking up. Well, after a successful day two of action here at the ISA World Surfing Games, day three will be launching off bright and early from Huntington Beach, California, starting tomorrow, 7.30 a.m. Tune in. <laughs>